Okay, in this video we are going to address the question that many of you have had. Will the wooden base on this water feature ever rot? So, as most of you probably know if you're watching this video, this concrete water fountain behind me is standing and supported by a wooden plywood base. So all of the weight is rested upon cinder block, but between the cinder block and the concrete structure is a sheet of plywood that is bolted to the bottom of this structure to hold its balance. That plywood also helps keep the river rock at the surface so the river rock doesn't fill the void because you need that void to maintain water volume. So it's fairly common knowledge that wood, when it gets wet, rots, which is why in a house or a fence, you have to worry about moisture, rotting out the wood, and ruining the integrity of your structure. However, rot is caused by organic material that needs both moisture and oxygen to live. So if wood is 100% dry all the time, it can never rot. And the inverse, if wood is wet 100% of the time, it cannot rot. This is something that has been studied and there's been lots of research with. They have found boats that are thousands of years old on the bottom of lakes and oceans that have just been kept there for centuries and never rotted. Oftentimes they get destroyed by the weather or other living creatures, fish and, and bottom feeders and whatnot. But typically speaking, if you just submerge wood entirely in water, it cannot rot. So we're gonna test that theory with my feature here. So the wood I used in this, did it rot? We're gonna find out. So I periodically will hose this thing off because it does sort of build up algae around the base of it and some on top. So I'll go hose this off to clean off some of that. I think I'm gonna start by inspecting the wooden cone that I put on the inside of the concrete there where it's visible. You can kind of see that little slant that's made of wood. I'm gonna pull that up and see what that's like. The underside where there's not as much algae feels pretty solid. The main thing is definitely the layers of the plywood splitting apart. I'm gonna pull some of this rock back and see what the base looks like. I'm gonna clean the pump and drain out some of this water so I can see this board better. This piece might be a little bit of a better reference because it's not plywood, it's just a solid two by six. This board is in no worse condition than when I first put it in there. All right, so I'm able to scrape off a layer of mud and algae and get down straight to the board. And I see no visible signs of decay. I know there is a cinder block here and a cinder block here to hold the weight of these pillars up and if I stand in the middle if it was rotting this would break out and I don't see it bowing any more than it did the day I put it in all right I'm happy with that this thing has been in for almost two years and it's balancing just as well as it was before and that plywood has not really decayed at all. Certainly not enough for me to worry about it. Now I'm not saying that there can't ever be any amount of decay on this thing. I'm sure as everything does it will decay over time but it's not an issue that I'm really worried about. I think I'll have several more years of this thing before it starts to look at all risky. I think so long as I keep this thing relatively full and running and that board is fully submerged it shouldn't rot. I do have this thing on a timer on my phone which allows it to shut off at nightfall to save on power and to avoid annoying my neighbors. I don't think it's an issue, but my point is it does shut off every night. So that board on the top there does dry out over the night, especially over the summer. That thing's gonna dry out over the night and then get soaked again in the morning. So that top one may be decaying to some rock. But the one underneath, the important one that holds up the river rock and keeps it all balanced is in very good shape. I'm gonna put that rock back and fill this thing back up and get it running again. If this answered your questions or it was at least intriguing, leave this video a like and subscribe to my channel and follow along. We'll see you guys in the next video. The hose right there, can you get it? Yeah. Sure. Sure, Daddy. Thank you.